So if you're trying to get your ex back and you've been watching my videos and you've done the right things and finally she's come back around and you've got your first date set with your ex, how should this date go down? Okay, well, the first thing that you need to know is that when you get her out to this date, she is going to be in a completely different emotional state than where you're at at the moment because you've been sitting around waiting her for, on her forever. But she's been out talking to other guys, dating other guys. She thought maybe you weren't the right one, so she broke up with you. And she's been living her life in a completely different emotional state than you have been for however long it's been since you broke up. And this is going to be really hard to deal with on the date because you're going to want to connect over old times. You're going to want to engage your emotions because you've missed her so much. And finally, she's right here in front of you. And she's not going to be in that space. And this is really going to hurt. And your job as a guy that's taking out a girl for the first time, because it's kind of like it's a new relationship at this point, is simply to create fun and good experiences for her, despite the fact that you're hurting inside, despite the fact that you miss her, despite the fact that you want to talk about old times and all this stuff, right? Or maybe straighten out old baggage. You can't do any of that stuff. You have to just simply focus on fun. Now, when I attracted my ex back into the circumstances, this is exactly what I experienced. And I remember sensing that I was pretty much just like a first date to her. She didn't care about old times or anything like that, okay? And I was the only one that valued the connection we used to have, all right? And I had to stuff this down so that way I could perform on the date and attract her back into my space, back into their relationship. Now, I'm gonna be honest, this story didn't end well. I did get her back into a relationship, but it only lasted for a couple months. And eventually she broke up with me again. And, you know, we did get together and hook up once or twice after that. But it pretty much ended in, you know, me finding somebody else and I have no clue what she's up to these days. But I'm sharing this video with you because a lot of people, you know, they want to get their ex back. They've been putting in the work with no contact and they've been um, trying to attract their ex back into their space. When you finally get her at the dinner table or whatever it is that you're going to go do when you first hang out, okay? It's very, very diff emotionally difficult to pull off. And I want you to know what you're getting into ahead of time. So if you found yourself in these circumstances, probably the best thing that you should do um, once you get this date set is to go ahead and book a call with me so that way we can have a one-on-one -on -one and I can get you equipped for what it is that you're going to encounter because I promise you this will be one of the most emotionally difficult things that you've ever dealt with in your life, okay? Because I've personally gone through it and I know. And if you're emotional, it's likely that you're going to make mistakes. And the more mistakes you make in these situations, the longer it is that you hear from her again, just like when you were in no contact. So if you want help with this situation in these circumstances, click on my profile right here, click the link in my profile and book a one-on-one -on -one call with me and I'll get you squared away. So that way you'll have a greater chance of success with your ex.